guys, Anmuf here, back again and in today's video, we are talking about Android customization. So it's not really a fixed customization tutorial or anything of that sort. I'm just going to take you guys to my Android device and show you guys how I theme my phone uh, to suit my likings and my dislikes. With that being said, if you guys like the video, leave a like, subscribe to the channel and let's get started. Okay, so one of the most imperative things while making your own Android device and customizing it is the wallpaper. Now in this tutorial, I'm using these wallpapers which are really dark and minimal in nature and they are from this application called Dark Ops. Now Dark Ops is essentially a wallpaper application which lets you choose from a wide variety of dark wallpapers, has a lot of categories and all of those good things and all in all, packs a really good collection of wallpapers when it comes to selecting cool and minimal wallpapers from different genres. So once you're sorted with the wallpaper, go check the app out, it will be linked in the description below. Okay, next up, when you've applied the wallpaper, we go to the launcher. Now, obviously, I'm using Nova Launcher and it's the free version. You can also get the pro version if you want to pay for it, but the free version is more than enough for me. Now, I've only changed the desktop grid to 5x5 and turned off the page indicators. You might want to switch on widget overlap or overlap when placing in the advanced settings. And I've turned the dock off to give more of a minimalist look. And the app widget drawer section, I have turned off the card background, so I get this non card background so I'm like taking away from the cool type of things and going to the minimal side of things also for icon pack I have chosen Delta icon pack now Delta icon pack is obviously not the best but then again I really like the choice of icons that we have it has a sort of vintage layer over it and looks really cool as you can see this is the application you have a wide variety of icons over here and it really separates itself from those material design or completely overblown icon packs that we have on the Play Store also has its very own wallpaper app section but in case you're using dark ops already uh, you might not want to select these wallpapers since they are pretty low res all right guys as far as the widgets are concerned i'm using super widget and minimal ui which is a super skin for super widget and it's basically a free application that has all of these nice amazing clock widgets and you can put on your clock in a really cool way on your home screen like I have and in order to put it just click and hold on your home screen go all the way down to widget select the appropriate size of the widget that you want to in my case it's 4 by 2 and you can add this really cool looking clock on your Android home screen now Swiping to the right, I have three icons and then I also have another widget called the month calendar widget. Now the month calendar widget is another really cool widget which is also an app and it's free as has a number of themes including material design as well as simple themes which keep it minimal like I have. And when you click on it, you can add different appointments and all of that good stuff. And all in all, that is it that is there on my Android device. And that is pretty much it guys. I know this video was kind of short but then again, I'm working on a lot of important projects that should be out in a few more days. With that being said, if you still like today's video, leave a like, subscribe to the channel, let me know if you guys want more tutorials like this. With that being said, this is the Android Guru signing out. I'll catch you guys next time. Have a great day. Peace out.